क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोस फ्रॉम ईकीडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी अ न्यू फॉर्म ऑफ इंटीग्रेशन दैट इज इंटीग्रेशन बाय पार्ट्स लेट अस सी बाय स्टार्टिंग प्रॉब्लम नंबर 1 we have integral x into sin 2x dx now how to identify this type that is a question integration by parts means whenever we have two functions in product form then we are going to integrate that function by using integral uv rule now what is the integral uv rule it is given as integral uv dx as u into integral v dx minus integral of d by dx of u into integral of v dx the whole dx now how to decide that which function is u and which function is v for that we need to understand different types of function and that different types of functions can be memorized by memorizing just one word that is liet l i a e and e L stands for logarithmic functions the function in which we have log i stands for inverse function like sin inverse cos inverse tan inverse and so on a stands for algebraic functions algebraic function means the function in which we don't have sin cos log anything t e stands for trigonometric function functions in which we have sin cos tan and so on exponential functions e stands for exponential functions exponential means e raised to x a raised to x in which x is our power now the reason behind to understand this word liet is we will check whether the two functions are in a given order or not meaning out of the two functions if i say one is inverse and one is trigonometric example it is given as trigonometric function into inverse function in that case i need to rearrange and write it as inverse function and trigonometric function as i comes first and then we have t similarly in the given problem they have asked you to integrate x into sin 2x therefore we should be very clear that which function belongs to which category here you can see x is our algebraic function as it does not contain any sin cos tan or neither it is a exponential function nor it is a logarithmic function and sin 2x is a trigonometric function therefore we have made it clear that this is a algebraic function and the second one is a trigonometric function if you see a comes first and then comes the t so the given order is correct but if it was written as sin 2x into x then we must write it again as x into sin 2x this part should be clear in order to find the integration of integral by parts therefore i is given as integral x into sin 2x dx after arranging the function in the form of liet we will consider first part as u and second part as v and arrange u and v in the form of integral uv that will give you u into integral v dx what is u x into integral sin 2x dx we have minus sign then we have a big integration followed by derivative of u that is d by dx of what is u it is x into integral of v dx v is our sin 2x dx covered by entire dx now remember this dx is for this integration and the last dx is for this bigger integration now let us see how to solve it further in the next step i is equal to x into integral of sin 2x we know very well it is minus cos 2x 
upon the derivative of the part which is replacing x as it is a composite function x is replaced by 2x its derivative will be 2 minus keeping the bigger sign as it is derivative of x is 1 into integral of sin 2x will again give you minus cos 2x upon 2 and the outer sign we have dx further we have minus x cos 2x upon 2 minus into minus will give you plus we have 1 upon 2 as constant and again we have integral cos 2x dx left in the last step we have minus x cos 2x upon 2 plus 1 upon 2 integral of cos 2x will be sin 2x divided by derivative of 2x that is 2 plus c therefore i is equal to minus x cos 2x upon 2 plus we have sin 2x upon 2 into 2 is 4 plus c this is our final answer remember friends whenever you will solve integration by parts you just need to arrange the given two functions in the form of liat the one which will come first you need to arrange it as u and the second one will be v i hope friends you have understood this problem thank you for watching this video stay tuned with ikida and subscribe ikida